Location Center from Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. A colocation center, colo or career hotel, is a type of data center where equipment, space, and bandwidth are available for rental to retail customers. Colocation facilities provide the space, power, cooling, and physical security for the server, storage, and networking equipment of other firms and also connect them to a variety of telecommunications and network service providers with a minimum of cost and complexity. Configuration. Many collocation providers sell to a wide range of customers, ranging from large enterprises to small companies. Typically, the customer owns the information technology or IT equipment and the facility provides power and cooling. Customers retain control over the design and usage of their equipment, but daily management of the data center and facility are overseen by the multi-tenant collocation provider. Cabinets. A cabinet is a locking unit that holds a server rack. In a multi-tenant data center, servers within the cabinets share raised floor space with other tenants, in addition to sharing power and cooling infrastructure. Cages. A cage is a dedicated server space within a traditional raised floor data center. It is surrounded by mesh walls and entered through a locking door. Cages share power and cooling infrastructure with other data center tenants. Suites. A suite is a dedicated private server space within a traditional raised floor data center. It is fully enclosed by solid partitions and entered through a locking door. Suites may share power and cooling infrastructure with other data center tenants or have these resources provided on a dedicated basis. Modules. Data center modules are purpose engineered modules and components to offer scalable data center capacity. They typically use standardized components, which make them easily added, integrated, or retrofitted into existing data centers and cheaper and easier to build. In a collocation environment, the data center module is a data center within a data center with its own steel walls and security protocol and its own cooling and power infrastructure. A number of collocation companies have praised the modular approach to data centers to better match customer demand with physical build-outs and allow customers to buy a data center as a service, paying only for what they consume. Building features. Buildings with data center inside them are often easy to recognize by the amount of cooling equipment located outside or on the roof. Collocation facilities have many other special characteristics. Fire protection systems, including a passive and active elements, as well as implementation of fire prevention programs in operations. Smoke detectors are usually installed to provide early warning of a developing fire by detecting particles generated by smoldering components prior to the development of flame. This allows investigation, interruption of power and manual fire suppression using handheld fire extinguishers before the fire grows to a large size. A fire sprinkler system is often provided to control a full scale fire if it develops. Clean agent fire suppression gaseous systems are sometimes installed to suppress a fire earlier than the fire sprinkler system. Passive fire protection elements include the installation of firewalls around the space so a fire can be restricted to a portion of the facility for a limited time in the event of the failure of the active fire protection systems or if they are not installed. 19 inch racks for data equipment and servers, 23 inch racks for telecommunications equipment, cabinets and cages for physical access control over tenants' equipment. Depending on one's needs, a cabinet can house individual or multiple racks. Overhead or underfloor cable rack or tray and fiber guide. Power cables usually on a separate rack from data. Air conditioning is used to control the temperature and humidity in the space. ASHRAE recommends a temperature range and humidity range for optimal electronic equipment conditions versus environmental issues. 
the electrical power used by the electronic equipment is converted to heat, which is rejected to the ambient error in the data center space. Unless the heat is removed, the ambient temperature will rise, resulting in electronic equipment malfunction. By controlling the space air temperature, the server components at the board level are kept within the manufacturer's specified temperature and humidity range. Air conditioning systems help keep equipment space humidity within acceptable parameters by cooling the return space air below the dew point. Too much humidity and water may begin to condense on internal components. In case of a dry atmosphere, ancillary humidification systems may add water vapor to the space if the humidity is too low to avoid static electricity discharge problems which may damage components. Low impedance electrical ground. Few, if any, windows. Collocation data centers are often audited to prove that they attain certain standards and levels of reliability. The most commonly seen systems are SSAE 16, SOC 1, Type 1 and Type 2, formerly SAS 70, Type 1 and Type 2, and the tire system by the Uptime Institute or TIA. For service organizations today, SSAE 16 calls for a description of its system. This is far more detailed and comprehensive than SAS 70's description of controls. Other data center compliance standards include Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act or HIPAA, Audit and PCI DSS standards. Power. Collocation facilities generally have generators that start automatically when utility power fails, usually running on diesel fuel. These generators may have varying levels of redundancy depending on how the facility is built. Generators do not start instantaneously, so collocation facilities usually have battery backup systems. In many facilities, the operator of the facility provides large inverters to provide AC power from the batteries. In other cases, customers may install smaller UPSs in their racks. Some customers choose to use equipment that is powered directly by 48 VDC nominal battery banks. This may provide better energy efficiency and may reduce the number of parts that can fail, though the reduced voltage greatly increases necessary current and thus the size and cost of power delivery wiring. An alternative to batteries is a motor generator connected to a flywheel and diesel engine. Many collocation facilities can provide redundant A and B power feeds to customer equipment and high-end servers, and telecommunications equipment often can have two power supplies installed. Collocation facilities are sometimes connected to multiple sections of the utility power grid for additional reliability. Internal connections. Collocation facility owners have differing rules regarding cross-connects between their customers, some of whom may be carriers. These rules may allow customers to run such connections at no charge or allow customers to order such connections for a monthly fee. They may allow customers to order cross-connects to carriers, but not to other customers. Some collocation centers feature a meet-me room where the different careers housed in the center can efficiently exchange data. Most peering points sit in collocation centers and because of the high concentration of servers inside larger collocation centers, most careers will be interested in bringing direct connections to such buildings. In many cases, there will be a larger internet exchange point hosted inside the collocation center where customers can connect for peering. See also career neutral data center.